Hey guys, welcome to my Iron Man One Year Challenge series. This is episode 83. Enjoy. So, I decided I'm going to go for the Seed Singer Wanted Orb. And I do have a scroll mission right now. Hold on, let me just find it here. And I have about a 57% success rate. So, it should be good, I guess. Better, you know, odds than I have. So, yeah, wish me luck on that. Alright, just finished up another Araxi task. And this is the sixth kill and the last kill for today. And let's see what we got. Overloads. Okay. That's not too bad. I always need overloads. So, yep. That's not too bad. Hopefully, the next time I come back, probably tomorrow, you know, I get that RXE eye, please. Please. Might as well get my next Reaper assignment. Jammo. No thanks. Two Harkins. That's gross. 22 Dagonoth Kings. No thank you. 14 Bars Brothers. Yes, I will definitely take that. Not too bad. Hopefully I get another Bars piece that I haven't gotten yet. Alright, well, the scroll voyage did return. And I checked it, and I failed that mission pretty miserably. But, that's fine, because the last four scrolls, I got them all. So, yeah, we'll just look out for the next one, and see if we get it next time. So, I have 877 Astromancer credits, and I don't think I can get them anymore. And I really don't want them in my bank anymore, so I'm just going to put points into this right now. I know at this point it's purely cosmetic because I don't have enough credits to really get the full outfit. I guess I get these uh, equipment, the roll top and the skirt. Oh, and I have the banner too. Alright, just finished my elf test I got a while ago, and it was pretty good. Got myself a lot of rare spikes and serenity skill and some raw sharks to help me. Uh, so I don't have to fish as much, so yeah, that's pretty good. Alright, let's move on to the next task. Ganodermic Beast, really good, easy, and yeah, gonna get some seeds off of that. Gano task done, got some okay amount of seeds. Alright, on to the next task. GG. There goes my Slayer Grind. I will be doing that later tonight when, you know, this is less crowded and less speakers. Second chest, Badoodle. Oh, yes! Wait, do I have a Frax Press Hard? Mmm, seems exciting either way, so let me just go to the bank real quick and confirm if this is a unique item or not. Alright, let's put it here. Oh, dang it. Unfortunately, it's not a unique item, but still, pretty good start to the bars run. Alright, six chests. Let's see if we can get the second item. Oh my god, wow, I, I forgot to kill freaking Varax, but I did get a Durax play leg, and I am sure that I've already gotten... Uh, you know, one already, but you know, that's cool. I got myself another uh, brow space, so not bad. Chest number eight, I think. Oh, wait a minute, Carl's offhand pistol crossbow. Hmm, I need to go to my bank real quick and check if I have that. All right, guys, moment of truth. Let's check. Okay, put that in there. Yes, awesome, guys. Another unique item into the loot tab. That is amazing. So, I got about 5 more bars just to do for my Reaper test, so I'm gonna do that. 3 items already, awesome. Alright guys, let's see if we can get a back to back. Oh! Wow, nice! I count that as a back to back. Awesome, uh, Clue Score Elite. I'm gonna be doing that after this bar test. Alright guys, last chest, and let's see if we get something good. Nope! Well, that's a good uh, Barrow's task because I got three items. One of them happened to be unique and also got an Elite Clue Scroll. So speaking of Elite Clue Scroll, I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. Alright, this is it guys. The unveiling of the Elite Clue Scroll reward. And we get... Oh! That's so bad. Alright, I'm going to reroll this and let's see if we get anything better. Confirm. Oh, yes, 236,000. I mean, it's still pretty bad, but it's better than the original one. So I'm about to wrap up all the god statues uh, for this month. So yeah, I got about like 140k construction experience and 90k per experience. Really nice for a few minutes of work. And yeah, that's about it. I'm going to move on to the troll invasion and get that out of the way as well. All right, finish up um, troll invasion. So let's put the experience reward into construction. Nice, a whopping 67,000 experience into construction. And that is it for the monthly DNDs, I guess. Alright, so I am getting kind of bored of doing uh, Big Chinchampa on the daily, so I'm gonna actually do some actual hunter training now uh, with the, you know, 
Chinchampa points that I do get from here and just buy, you know, all the quota tickets that I can to, you know, hunt some grandmas. Okay, so to start off with my actual uh, hunter grind, I'm going to get the enhanced yak uh, tree stick, if I pronounced that right, if I didn't, whatever. So what I need to do is I just need to capture a thousand of these creatures total and I'll be able to get it. So if you didn't know, this stick gives 6% experience whenever you like do anything hunter related in terms of getting hunter experience. So yeah, that's going to be great. So I'm going to do that now and then I'm probably going to head over and finish up the elf medium diaries. Uh, I'll explain why later. Sprite 1000. Oh, 1000 and 1. Oh, okay. I just missed that dialogue. But okay. I am supposed to get the enhanced tree now. Okay, so I finally managed to get him to talk to me about upgrading this goddamn stick. So it's time for me to upgrade it. Oh, yes. Nice. I got myself the enhanced yuck tree stick. And it turns out it's 5% bonus, not 6%. I misread it, but 5% is still amazing. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get the medium uh, Elf City Diaries done. Alright, just finished off all the easy uh, Terrian Diaries. So I'm going to go ahead and get the reward for that. Sorry guys, late recording, but I just hit 97 fishing. And that means I only need two more levels to go for 99 fishing. I think eventually I will hit that just through uh, catching fish for PVMing. Because I pretty much am always uh, in need of food. So yeah, that's probably going to happen eventually. But it's like a 1.1 mil to 98, so it's going to take a while though. But yeah, overall, very nice fishing gains. Okay, so about the task system, here we go. Nice, I got myself the Terran Quiver 1. Which is pretty good, I guess, for storing uh, ammo. And also, Antique Lamp, I'm going to be putting that into construction, as usual. So, I need to get the medium version of this, and I'll explain why. Uh, with the medium diaries done for Terran, I no longer need to use bait to catch the Gremwalls. So, it's going to be easier for me to, you know, train there and just get lots of experience without having to use the meat. And my next assignment is Adoraxi. Perfect, because I was actually going to go and do some Araxi. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that soon. But just in case, for those of you that don't know about this, you can actually use the enhanced uh, Yakui tree stick to uh, get more experience when you cash it in. As you can see, I got 300 bonus uh, with that stick. So yeah, whenever you have to, you know, cash in the butterflies, make sure you equip that and you will get free handsome amount of experience. Alright, fourth kill and last kill for today. Alright, what should we look? Oh, oh, yes! That's my fifth effigy. All right, I'm gonna go check and see if I can open it, and then head over to some low shark worms. Sweet, I can open this one. All right, first one into fletching, and let's see what the second one is. Uh, we got fishing and farming. That should be doable. Okay, next one is here we go. Ah, oh, construction thieving. Okay. Well, I do have five effigies now, so I guess I will do that eventually, like probably tomorrow. Alright, just finished my lava strike room task, and everything went fine. No P cares, luckily. And I was able to finish this task in under an hour, 56 minutes on the dot, as you can tell by my penance aura. Uh, and again, you know, I didn't get anything from this freaking lava strike worms. So, yeah, that kind of sucks. Alright, let's start off with a plus two herbal boost. Should be easy to get. And I just got it. Perfect timing, too. Woo! Man, that was scary. Nice, I'm gonna save that dragon lamp. Alright, guys, looking for a plus three construction boost. And... Wait, I can open this one, though. So, might as well just do that. Should be 93. Alright, okay. Let's see what's the next thing. Oh, nice. Runecrafting and summoning. I can open that, I believe. Oh, 95 runecrafting. Yes, I can open this one. So, let's do that. Oh yeah, 96 construction. I can just uh, boost it now, perfect. All right, let's open up all three. Yeah, let's go, one more, one more. All right, here we go, nice. Okay, let's move on and see what else we can open. Ah, uh, fletching and cutting. Yes, I can open that as well, perfect. Another lamp opened. All right, let's see if we can get this boost. 97 smithing, this is it guys. Please, please don't degrade. Here we go, smithing. Perfect, and the last one too, right here. There we go. Woo! And the last one, I can't boost to 97 crafting, so that's fine because I'll just open it with summoning. 
All right, guys, I opened up all five relatively easily. Okay, anyways, let's put it all into construction. Wow, 38,000 experience into construction. So let's do it again. <laughs> five times, that's crazy. And I already gained like 25 from a bunch of times, you know, for opening the previous one. So yeah, that's insane. I must have gotten like 200k plus construction experience in this one sitting of just opening FG sweet 90k to 93 construction nice all right guys that's eight kills for today of Rexor and I finished my river task please give me something nice oh okay whatever that's okay I'm not considered dry yet so you know we'll wait till tomorrow all right let's get my next slayer task and it is Oh, 53 Adamant Dragons. Um, not as exciting as Rune Dragons for sure, but it's, you know, something I've never killed before, and I know it has a chance of dropping a Dragonfall Helm, which is, like, incredibly slim, like, winning the lottery, kind of slim. But, you know, it's exciting, so yeah, let's do it. Guys, this is amazing. Five penguins in one spot. <laughs> awesome. So, I believe this is the second time ever that's happened to me, or, you know... There was like five penguins in this spot. I remember doing this like, I don't know what episode it was, a long, long time ago. Oh yeah, you fell from a trap, oh uh, yeah. Okay guys, just finished up all the medium tasks, that is great. Now I am finally done with my preparations, essentially for catching grandmas to train my hunter, so I'm gonna get the quiver too. Ah, task system, there we go. Yes, nice, finally it's done. Quiver two has been achieved. And right here somewhere I should say I don't have to use bait to catch ground walls. So yeah, there you go. Ground walls won't need their traps baiting anymore, so that's perfect. And here we go, antique lamp, put that into construction. 30,000, amazing. Alright, time to get my reaper assignment. 20 legions! Alright, I'll take this for now and see if I have enough keys. And let's go and check. Sweet, I have enough keys. Alright, here we go guys one construction tick and bam 93 construction has been achieved got it a lot faster thanks to the effigies and stuff so yeah that's pretty nice uh well that's it it's only effigies at 93 even though construction has like so many perks at every single level and 741k and change to 94 construction that will take a while <laughs> for sure second kill of the day guys we get whoa wow Third, Araxite Pheromone. Interesting. I mean, only one is good. And the second one was nice because of a placeholder. But the third one is kind of like, you know, too much. Overkill, essentially. I would swap this for Araxi's Eye or Web in a heartbeat. <laughs> but still, pretty cool. Alright guys, third kill, Badoodle. Nice, Magic Seeds. Alright. Loving that farming experience gains. Alright guys, here I am at the new area of the Brimhaven dungeon and there's this meal thing that I can cleanse for some really nice farming experience. Okay, 10k free. That's not bad. Well, I just finished my first ever adamant dragon task and honestly, they are quite easy. Uh, pretty much like the same as mythro dragons to be honest. It's only slightly tougher, like barely though. Like it's really hard to notice the difference at this point. And um, they're not a very interesting task, I'll be honest. Like, uh, they don't give much other than like some noted youths and you know the traditional noted bars and ores that most mana dragons drop nowadays. Well, let's get my next task, shall we? 268 Dagonauts. All right, easy. Let's do it. For the Dagonaut task, I decided I'm going to actually go to DKs again and just do, I guess, uh, one whole task at DKs. Just because um, it's something I haven't done in a while and I should be able to do it in a relatively fast time. So it won't delay me too much and it's always nice to get some new drops. Maybe I'll get a pet, you know. We'll see. I should be getting a level if I check this. Yes! Just in time. Perfect. 89 farming has been achieved. Although I could have gotten it yes uh, tomorrow because, you know, magic trees are pretty fast to grow. But yeah, that's a pretty good milestone because I can plant uh, three spare tree seeds, which is pretty good. I mean, I'm going to run out of seeds very soon anyways, but still a nice uh, milestone. So here we go, 500k to uh, 90 farming. So I have some pretty cool plans that I want to tell you guys. Alright, let me head over to the minigame spotlight section here. In about four days, the pets control uh, will be spotlighted. So... 
basically I'm going to be grinding out pest control for some valors and I'm going to get myself uh, the seed aside and probably void I'm not sure about void yet I'm, I'm going to research a bit and see if, if you know it's worth it but yeah I'm definitely getting the seed aside when uh, it comes out in four days but yeah that's the plan it's going to be great farming experience I'm going to be doing some extra slayer tasks I used to not do like um, dark beast because CSI will provide some pretty good a uh, farming experience from just doing those tasks so yeah it'll be really nice and that is it for today's video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the progress thus far. So I didn't get as many drops as I would have liked, especially a spider leg piece, but it's fine. I was on point, uh, you know, to getting them on average uh, for the past few episodes, so you know, gotta go dry sometimes. And anyways, uh, I will probably be uploading another, you know, episode in like three days probably. Because I am getting back to regular schedule, all the family stuff is, you know, almost done. So yeah, look forward to another video, I guess, in three days. Other than that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.